Oh, we are back with another edition of Week Ass Topic Week. Kyle, you got one more for me? Yeah. Uh, uh, this is basically like I, I, I sit in a car or uh, I b- listen to music sometimes or a podcast while I'm driving. And I was thinking, how do you listen to music? Which, yeah. It's like, what's your favorite way to listen to music? Yeah. So we're talking, it's headphones. It's maybe, you know, like, you know, earbuds. Sound system. Yeah, you know. Maybe through your shitty speakers on your TV. Studio <laughs> monitors. It could be through your laptop. It could be also, like, CD, vinyl. Do yeah. you stream it? Do Different you like formats, to like Digital yeah. formats, like, you know, like uh, waves or, you know, lossless files. Or, you know, maybe even tape. Maybe you're stealing it. How, yeah. How are some of your favorite ways? Do you want to just like uh, maybe a quick one? What do you got? So I already alluded to it, but I plug it in digital format, basically on my phone into the speakers on my truck. Mm -hmm. And so I like to listen to the stereo sound. I like to listen to the different aspects of left and right. And basically, I, I recently what I found is you know it, it's a new truck it's like a 2018 yeah truck and it's got really good sound system actually noise and I can hear things I've never listen I've never heard before even with like like earbuds yeah like in a song I heard a song I've heard like a hundred times okay there's like uh it's a brand new song it comes to this point where it's like a bridge and there's like a Woo! In the background. Woo! And I'm like, what the fuck? I've never heard that before. <laughs> Hell yeah. And, <laughs> and it, it echo, and it's like this, it, 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 I, I like hearing that stuff. And when Interesting. You're Im- when you're like immersed <laughs> in it, you know, yeah. peanut oil, when you're immersed in it, <laughs> it for me, that's what I like, is how, having the space in between the speakers. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. It's a big ass cab. And it, it's mixed that way with space. Exactly. Gotcha. And I feel like that's maybe how it's supposed to be heard. Maybe not digitally. Well, I mean, a lot of times, know. like people maybe don't know this trick. Um. Oh, it's it's what we've done. One hundred and one ways to listen to music. No, I mean even to mix your album, if you know you bounce it down to a CD or some format to listen to your album in a car with a stereo, that car yeah. stereo. Because the thing is with a car, there are like zero reflections. That's why you want to do a yeah. mix down blast track in your car to be like, I want this up more. I want this down more. EQ this a little differently in your car. It's like, that's kind of what you want. So you're saying that that translates, let's say you have a total of four speakers in your yeah. car. You think that translates down to two speakers on your headphones? It translates really well. Yeah. Because it's your car Left mix. and right. Yeah. yeah okay. Um, I like to do a thing. And the thing is, that's a gr- really great way to be because I'm like, that's how most people are listening to music. But yeah. another way that most people are listening to music is through earbuds. Mm-hmm. I, you know, we mix through studio monitors Sometimes they're big ass monitors. Sometimes they're really pro, you know, like these are thousand, twelve, you know, it's like hundred dollar or whatever per speaker monitors. Million dollar. I mean, I mean, they're they're expensive monitors, you know, and stuff like that. And it's like I want to say like more money than I know what to count because we go to a bigger studio, and it's like you can mix on those all day long. But I'm like, what are people going to listen to? Yeah, they don't have those. My favorite thing to listen to is Apple earbuds because they're your $30. Tough sell on those. Like, because I'm like, that's what people (laughs) are listening to on it. Okay. Because your speakers are going to affect the mix. They're going to affect the, you know, whatever MP3 waveform that you're getting. You're thinking of like 
the status quo. Yeah. The, I like, want to hear. General, when you buy your phone, those are the, the headphones you've got with it. That's what everybody's going to hear. I like to buy the status quo, the one. And I mix the podcast on that. I listen to our own records on that. Because I want to hear what people will hear. Ooh, sad like, story. Ooh, it's a tough one. You listen to those all the time? Uh, Sometimes. Jam. Like, I'll, I'll, I'll compare them to other uh, other local bands in San Diego that do their records. I compare ours to theirs <laughs> on the same headphones. Ah, 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 ah. Whoa, that's, you know, that is what it is. We you know? missed the mark on those. <laughs> exactly. Or the opposite way. Um. So it's, you know, I like to get the that regular feedback. And also because it's 30 bucks. You know, it's like your regular headphones. If you break them, you know, it's 30 bucks. You get another another set. And that, like I said, I mix our podcast on that. If you can get like a good sound, you know, to noise ratio and making sure you're not um, peaking anywhere. And well, you step it down. So you start big and then you go smaller. So you start with like your full, like... Elephant ear headphones and then move I, down. I, I to... like to like to track on the bigger headphones. Okay, and then like so you don't miss any frequencies and, and then move the smaller yeah, ones. Yeah, and check and against monitors. But at at the point that I'm doing now, because I'm I'm not mixing our records, I'm uh, just checking them. And we we started doing this in the studio. I started started checking in the car and like I like I mentioned with you. And I started checking on Apple earbuds. And so, like, with the uh, mix engineer, Jeff Forrest, I yeah. started talking to him. I'm like, I want to check this on Apple earbuds. And he's like, makes sense. He's like, that's what you get with your phone. That's what most people get. 30 bucks. That's what you're going to get. Check. So what what do you listen to music on, though? I um, What do you listen to music on? Those are a big thing because I spend a lot of my money on those. But I also like earbuds. I still get my... my and when I say like earbuds, I'm not going for hundred or you know two hundred dollar earbuds. I'm going for maybe forty 50 or, under? or okay. fifty dollar earbuds of the MDR Sony's. Okay, it is what it is. It, you get a little more bass with those as opposed to the Apple earbuds. And I like listening to earbuds because I'm like I hear so much more because when you hear with just two isolated tracks, left, right, panned into your ears, you hear the dynamics. To me, a whole lot more than with like four or more speakers because it's just yeah. the two into your two ears. Yeah. That's what you hear directed into your ears. I'm like, I like it. And you can obviously control the volume with your phone or whatever. And it that's what you're meant to hear, the left and right. And because like I'm coming at it from like an audio engineer perspective, I'm like left, right, that's all you hear. I'm like, it's you don't hear the soundscapes. As you would with multiple like Dolby or like you know seven point one or whatever type of speakers, I like it. It's just two, and sometimes it gets even dumbed down more to one to your cell phone. To me, I feel like you catch it more with earbuds than you do with like a sound system and stereo. But that's all to bring it back to, and I'm gonna like hijack this a little bit. I will say. You know, even with technology and like you get more with like lossless files and waves and stuff like that. I think vinyl still sounds the best. You get something yeah. different out of it. You get I don't like, have a good enough system to uh establish that. I have a shitty sound system. And I heard our own record being played, because I you know, we have it. Um uh cutting ties, cutting losses, which we do have for sale. Uh <laughs> <laughs> Just so you know. Uh, we do have, you know, it's like we do have it on vinyl and I like played it the other day. Um, huge. Oh, yeah. It sounded big. I'm like, every bullshit thing that people say is like, Vinyl's better because it's more authentic. It's Vinyl's story. dead. And, you know, it's just the way it sounds. It's thick and it's like heavy and that's the, the sound of the record, man. It's true. It's true. It's true. A hundred percent true. It's true. Hundred percent true, but the thing is, it is so inconvenient. It is so heavy. It is so expensive. And if you scratch it, you're fucked. Eh, well, you know, it's like the, that's that's the deal with it. And so, um, realistically, stream it or buy it on MP3. But if you and want, if it, you like it a lot, then you buy the vinyl. Yeah, buy the vinyl. That's kind of all I had. It's a sample. That just... But I hijacked that. Do you have anything else to add? No, I just like listening to it in a full sound system. 
Yep. I, I want to Headphones, be... I don't like. I, I like having the over the ear, but in the ear, I mean, they kind of. I have really small small ear holes. Yeah. <laughs> so it hurts my ears after a while. I guess Even I have the smallest, like. I, I like it because I'm so immersed. Because I, I want to be immersed and just cut off and then, like, listen to Well, the when I'm driving, thing. you can't be fucking immersed. I know. Like, All right. Oh, yeah. There's an emergency and I probably should just drive right through it. Just blast through there. Like, man, I feel like I'm being, like, you know, like. <laughs> I feel like I'm being an asshole right now. Oh, well. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> listen to my podcast. Anyways, that's kind of all I got. Uh, you want to close it out? Yeah, let's close it. Well, I think this is going to be the last one of the week ass topic week for episode sixty nine. We made it the whole week. Woo! <laughs> we both did that. That was lame. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thank you, thank you so much. Um, we love you guys. Uh, thank you again to everyone who's been tuning in. Thank you again to all the Patreon supporters and very special thank you to Doug Christ for bringing us to $69 for episode 69 on the Patreon. Thank you, Doug. We have, you know, over 60 episodes, well over 60 episodes on Summer Patreon. Summer of Doug Christ nine. <laughs> Doug Christ nine, baby. Uh, yeah, thank you so much for that. It was a dumb gag and he helped us get it us to that, to that goal but fuck we're rambling on and we've been doing it all week and uh you know we will see you for episode 70 for our regular episode i think we're done after this actually we, we just we should just tap out yeah i think this is it we've achieved everything we've wanted to no i think we got to get up to episode 420 oh, 182 <laughs> 187 and then to 420 yeah and then 666 <laughs> I think we should get up to like, you know, 86. Yeah. Yeah. We could try. We got a lot of numbers. If you guys have more numbers, oh, we got 666 too. Fuck, man. We got, we got way more. We we're can not just skip all the way there. We're not done yet. We got more. We will see you next time. All we right. love you. Bye. Bye bye.